the next generation of lifestyle awareness that will transform your life significantly. Hi, welcome to Living Wow Out Loud. I'm your host, Callie Ray, founder of the Living Wow Center and author of the book, Eight Lessons Lupus Taught Me from Surviving to Thriving with Autoimmune Diseases. Living Wow is a lifestyle of choice and intention that was born from the truth that number one, your body is designed to heal if you give it the environment to do so. Number two, you don't need a label or permission to be the expert in your own body. And number three, more than 80% of all diseases can be prevented or reversed by lifestyle. Unfortunately, this isn't what we're taught in our standard American diet and lifestyle culture. This podcast is a voice of hope and community where you, you will learn how to live a life of thriving that honors and embraces those three truths. Though you are an individual, you are not alone and you can thrive living wow too. How are you really? My heart is heavy and I feel like it's necessary to speak about mental health here on this platform in a way that is quite real and raw. The living wow lifestyle was created as an alternative to the living sad lifestyle that we default into with our culture and beliefs. It has evolved as an awareness of the choices you make on a daily basis from the food you choose to consume or not, the self-care you make time for or don't, and the priority you give to your health and ultimately thriving. It's learning to speak the language of your body so that you can become the expert in your body and provide the environment to heal. I think that maybe you think it's always making the right choice or doing the right thing. And I want to be very clear that life is not that way. You can't change something you're not aware of. And that's why I make a point of teaching and supporting so that you can find hope to live your best life. Last week here on the podcast, I was honest about my struggle with the season of fall as it historically meant the season of illness for me and the infections and flares that would morph and linger for months. Living Wow was born out of the transformation and the look back across two decades of my life where this cycle was rampant. It's my story of hope. During those decades, I was trapped in a negative health cycle of chronic pain, depression, and anxiety, but I didn't recognize those labels because it was all I had known as an adult. And so I believed it was normal. I worked in healthcare where my patients and their families were all in crisis. And compared to them, I felt so healthy and blessed. When life would get overwhelming with work, finances, relationships, marriage, parenting, pain. There were times when I wanted it all to end. I thought it would be better and certainly easier to die than live. I was completely hopeless and felt like I was drowning in a whirlpool. I wanted the world to go away. I'm not sure that anyone knew that I felt this way because I certainly wasn't proud of it. In some way, I was ashamed that I could feel so bad when others around me were obviously suffering so much more than I was. The lies that I told myself of the world being better off without me and my family appreciating me more if I was dead were spinning in my head. Despite long sobbing drives to nowhere parked in contemplation and reflection, the phone calls to check in at just the right time and a hug that you didn't know I needed. I always came back home, I went back to work, and I put that smile back on my face for everyone around me. I'm sharing this extremely painful time with you now in case you are feeling that way at all. I want you to know that you are worth it and that you matter. As the ripple of suicide again crashes into my life with the loss of a family friend, I realize that I need to speak this to you. I want to be transparent that there is hurt and pain and challenges everywhere. Even when you're living wow, it's okay to talk about it. It's okay to ask for help. It's okay sometimes to just survive. I think that that really is why I have Living Wow. 
I feel like when we're making choices that support our mental health and our physical health, we're more true to who we are and more true to who we were born to be. And that makes us less likely to suffer. It doesn't take away. And I certainly don't want anyone to feel shame because they're dealing with depression. I have been there and it has hit me too close to home too often. Autoimmune disease can really mess with your chemicals, hormones, digestion, and mood, and they're all interrelated. I've been there. I know what it feels like to feel so hopeless that ending your life seems like a better option than living it one more day. If you're feeling that way, if, if you know someone that needs I can't, it's hard for me to even say that if you know somebody that's feeling that way, because so often you don't. Sometimes you know someone is struggling with mental health and you can reach out and you can love on them. But sometimes, like my friend, literally, if you lined up a hundred people, he would have been the last I would have ever thought would have taken his life. I just, I would not have ever seen it coming. My message today is that I want you to know that living well is a lifestyle of choice. It's being aware that you are making choices that are supporting you, your best life, your best health. If it feels too hard, if it feels too far away, don't feel guilty. Please don't feel hopeless. Please reach out. I just want you to know that you're loved and that you make a difference just as you are Doing the best you can is exactly what Living Wow is about. It's doing the best we can. Mental health is just as important as physical health. Just don't believe the lies in your head. You matter. You matter. And we need you on this earth. We love you and we care about you and you matter. Hey, if you find value here on the Living Wow Out Loud podcast, will you please share it with your friends and take a minute to rate it on the platform that you're listening on? That's how we live wow out loud. You know that more people need hope and they need the messages shared. And that's how we get recognized among all the noise. This is where you find your voice. Will you please share and subscribe and rate so that we can grow? After my personal transformation from surviving to thriving with autoimmune diseases, I was completely astounded that the experience was not what I expected it to be. Instead of resenting my body and being forever trapped with a legacy of bad genes, as I had believed would be my fate, I looked and felt 20 years younger. I had dropped weight that had plagued me for decades, eliminated chronic pain that no doctor, therapy, or medicine could relieve and found energy that I hadn't had since I was 16 years old. Because this is not what I expected, and because I wish someone would have told me that there is another way than sad, I wrote the book, Eight Lessons Lupus Taught Me from Surviving to Thriving with Autoimmune Diseases. As I began to share the book and the message of Change Your Story, Living Wow was born. After years of continuing to learn and study how and why lifestyle has such an impact on disease and the world being torn apart by a global pandemic, I can't stand by any longer keeping it to myself. You have to understand that the power is in your hands. The power is in your body. The power is in your lifestyle. The Living Wow Center is a holistic wellness practice that utilizes the framework of the Living Wow Lifestyle to identify system failures or maintenance needs. Whether you just need a tune-up or a complete systems overhaul, we support you as an individual to get back out on the journey and living well. We will work with you to determine levels of function, needs, tools, resources, and or providers that may be best equipped to guide you as you step out of the negative health cycle and turn it into a positive health cycle. The Living Wow Center offers a revolutionary, comprehensive approach to healing, coaching, and support that is necessary in our complex, sad world. 
Schedule your complimentary consultation today to see how Living Wow can support you. I am super excited to announce Supercharge for you. We are changing the name of the Living Wow Challenge to more clearly represent the monthly support program where you take Living Wow for a 10-day spin. I know, 10 days doesn't seem like much, but it is. And that's why it's now Supercharge. Living Wow Supercharge is a 10-day supported focus on eating a clean, nutritionally dense diet with intention as you jumpstart into the Living Wow lifestyle. You will feel lighter, more energetic, and empowered with your nutrition. You will experience the power of nutritional healing with less pain, more energy, and a better mood. The Supercharge includes a comprehensive 10-day seasonal menu, recipes, videos, quick start guides, and links to resources. You begin with a prep, then daily support, and wrap up with a review. This is the fastest, most immersive way to get started and feel the effects of Living Wow now. Right now, go to livingwowcenter.com. That's L-I-V-I-N-G-W-O-W-C-E-N-T-E-R.com to sign up now for the next Supercharge, running the 1st to the 10th of the month. Early sign up ensures you a spot and gives you time to complete your preparation assignments as you gear up to supercharge. Wow, you just finished another episode of Living Wow Out Loud. I hope you leave today empowered to live your best life and thrive. If you're ready to jump in and learn a little bit more about Living Wow, come check out the Living Wow Center. That's L-I-V-I-N-G-W-O-W-C-E-N-T-E-R dot com. And maybe consider joining our next Living Wow Challenge. We run the 1st to the 10th of every single month. See you soon.